Okay, this is Frank Nacella speaking. Uh, we're here in a pizza parlor in uh, Stewart, Florida. Our intention here is to show contract cleaners how you can take an account like this. You can make money, but you can also make the customer very happy. So our system can be used on this floor and would not have to be stripped for the next 10 to 15 years. That's number one. So there's nothing dangerous about the process. It's extremely simple. Now, I, when we walked in here, they had two uh, carpets. They had one carpet right here for the customers to walk on, and they had another carpet by the door. What I would suggest for the contract cleaners, you throw into the deal when you get it for the customer that you'll clean the carpet every time you come. I'm going to show you how to clean this carpet in less than three minutes. And the carpet will stay clean, and it'll be clean. So this man doesn't have to take the carpet out and have it clean. You will add that to your service, and I would suggest you even throw it in. This is a dry process, and actually, if there's customers walking in here, during this process, it's perfectly okay. Just to be sure if there's any, any trash, you can see this place is relatively clean. But if there's anything on the floor, we want to dress mop it. You just come in, no problem. Come on in. So, our process will have no effect on our customers at all. I've equipped the machine that we're using. We're using a 1500 RPM machine. I've equipped the machine with a hair pad. That's hog's hair. We're actually going to clean and polish the floor using a hog's hair pad and a microfiber pad. This is the microfiber pad that we're going to use for polishing. These are the only two pads we ever use for our system. So the first thing I'm going to do is prep the floor. Floor prep is used to open the pores of the finish, whatever on this floor, take out the dirt, and close the pour in one operation. All right, we'll start the process. All we do is spray a stream. I don't know if the camera can pick this up, but you will as I, think, as I go through the store. We're using a product that takes the dirt out of the finish. It actually opens the pores of the finish, takes the dirt out when he's going forward, and when he backs up, it closes the pores of the finish. The chair needs to move too. Yeah, we have to move. Wait until we get out there. This takes itself off every time it's applied. Okay. And three inches, the length of my index finger, does 1,000 square feet. Let me show you how much I'm going to use to polish this whole place. Yeah. Okay? Yep. That's how much I'm going to use to polish the whole place. That's all I need. That's it. Yep. yep. Now I'm actually polishing this floor. And when we're finished up with the dust month, we're done. That's it. There is nothing else to it. No, I, well, why would I mind? I know, that's what I'm telling you. It looks like it's, it's effortless. But you can walk on it while you're doing it. It really doesn't look like putting too much energy into it, so... What I would suggest a contractor does is when a, an establishment has carpets like this, he has to have outside, and he has this one. This is brand new. I'm going to show you how to clean the carpets, and you clean the carpets for free for the customer. 
I would suggest you don't charge for the carpet cleaning. But I'm going to show you how simple it is. We're using Zing Stays Clean Encapsulator, soil encapsulator, ready to use with a rechargeable sprayer. We have the sprayer adjusted to a mist. Can you see that? And we're using a brush on wheels. The, the dark side of the brush is coarse brush and the light side of the brush is light. Let me show you how you clean the carpet. All you do is spray the carpet and this will dry in seven minutes. And the next time they vacuum the carpet, all the dirt will come out. This will turn into a transparent crystal. And this is all you do to clean the carpet. This is on wheels. You can actually see a difference where I'm going. Can you see it? Even though this is a new carpet. See the difference? Yep. And it's very, very simple. And that's all there is to it. There is nothing else. And it's all done. We have this carpet, and this is right inside the entranceway. And you would clean this exactly the same way. This is really no big deal. You could charge for this if you want to, but I would throw it in. And the reason I throw it in is it would keep your competition out. Because your competition is not going to clean their carpets for free. Okay, now watch this, how this cleans. You see that? Can the camera pick that up? See how easy that is? And the carpet's clean. That's all there is to it. Now I'm using the coarse side. You then flip it over and use the soft side. You see that? Raises the nap of the carpet, and the carpet's as good as new. Any dirt that's in that carpet will turn into a transparent, encapsulated piece of dirt that you can't see. When you vacuum it, you'll pull it right out. If he doesn't vacuum it, he can bring it outside here and hit against the wall, and all the crystals will fall out of the carpet. That's all there is to it.